24 hours, every day. New Jersey's own news network. This is News 12, New Jersey. Now, the morning edition. Straight ahead on the morning edition this Friday, the state tries to figure out just what went wrong with HIP of New Jersey. And presidential hopeful and former Senator Bill Bradley stumping in the Midwest yesterday calling for an end to violence in schools. Welcome back to the morning edition. It is Friday. It's May 21st of uh, May 21st, 1999. I'm Frank Cipolla. My co-host today is Melinda Murphy. She is filling in for Mizar Turdu and filling in for himself today is James. He's in the Weather Center. He has a first look, James. All righty. Good morning, Frank. Good morning. Five people who spent some time in Daytona Beach are suing the hotel they checked into. The five, who are black, say employees at the Adams Mark Hotel discriminated against them. They say they were required to wear orange wristbands, overcharged for their rooms, and generally harassed by hotel employees. The owner of the hotel denies the charges. Rescue